Hi everybody, uh, today we're going to have a look at the awning on the Grand California behind me. Uh, so this is an option on the Grand California from the factory, uh, but we'll show you how it works and uh, let's get to it now. So the first thing we need is the awning winder, which on the Grand is located up here. So just unplug these from here and then pull it this way and out. Uh, it just nicely comes out of the handle, it's here. So, And then to extend it, twist the black, pull it out, twist it back in again and that locks the pole in place and then this end goes up here and you just start unwinding as you can see it's quite nice and easy to unwind and keep coming so I'm going to stop about there for the moment really this can come out as far as you want it to given the height that it's on here but obviously when it's out this far it does put a bit of strain on the top section here but it's fine to do that uh, you can come out from here but I would come out as far as you need to so that obviously you can get the legs out um, now getting the legs out is really really easy it's really simple it's on this I'll start on this side so I can show you um, but the legs are incorporated into this front edge uh, just as they are on the other awnings that's here uh, so to get the awning out the easiest way to do it you just pop your finger behind this silver flask here and that will pull the, the awning hole out so it comes out from on here and then you can literally just pull it off and put it down legs come out and at that point then you can put that down uh, and then the other side is just the same uh, so again I'll just pop that in there so it comes out pull it over and lock it back up again. Now if you want to move this further out, because we'll do it now, we'll put it out to its maximum way that you can do from on there. Obviously the further it gets out from the vehicle, you could, like we do on the uh, Ocean model, if you're doing this on your own, if you check out that video, I've already done that, you can just move these forward a bit. So you can move them out a little bit that's there, and then get your awning pole, pop that in and bring it out even further. So now you'll notice that this is all, i use this as a, as a guide for a minute, you'll see this is all a bit floppy, it's on the top. If you just turn it back ever so slightly, so as I say I've turned it back round ever so slightly and now you can see there's a gap just above here to the top canvas, it just gets it all nice and tight then uh, on the top of your canvas. And that gives you a maximum width of awning. A lot of space underneath this awning, uh, this in there, but I will just quickly read you a bit from the handbook. If you haven't seen one of these before, this is the Grand California handbook. Uh, if, you, if you buy a California in your own one, um, most people don't, ever, don't read the handbook, but I just thought it was worth pointing out. It says, the awning offers protection against sun and light rain, but does not provide all weather protection. And that's quite important. I think I've emphasized that on videos before. It says, sudden wind, heavy rain or snow could damage the awning. And obviously at that point then we would advise you to, to, to close the awning. And it's quite important from those because customers have in, in the past, unfortunately, if the sudden wind's picked up and this part of the awning has, has gone up and over the top of the vehicle uh, that's in there, which is why I always recommend you put at least one temp peg in both of the legs at any one time because uh, that obviously stops that from doing it, can't lift up. Uh, also as well it stops anybody kicking, if somebody accidentally walked past and kicked it. Uh, not so important on this model because it's got a lot more strength in it from here so if one of the legs did go, so for example on here, if this leg went away now, obviously it's not actually going to damage the damage it like it would do probably on the, uh, on the actual ocean model. Uh, but still not ideal as with all these things that's on here, it's a lot of tension that's up at the top. Uh, so that's how it's all gone up as you can see nice really big area uh, that's underneath here so uh, you know if you were, if you were somewhere in the sun in the summer holidays and things like that it gives you lots of nice cover under here it makes it like a nice outside area uh, so you can eat and things like that here as well i've just put the table and chairs up just to give you an idea of the size of the canopy can come out uh, you probably saw when we started the video uh, we don't have this all the way out in the showroom uh, and i think a lot of people probably don't put it all the way out either uh, when you're using it you might not do so you can put it wherever you like along this section that's on here obviously we in the showroom had it to about here i think something like that allows you to have the table and chairs out that's in there and it just reduces your your footprint so now i'll talk you through how to uh, put it back down again so first thing as before so take these off and hot them from here and just pull them back up 
and then reach it up into its mechanism. So that just folds into, into there and then you pull it forward and the whole thing then comes into, into one side. I'll show you again on the other. So, guessing it so you've got, your, got it like this. It's here and then put it nose end in so it's in there. So there's a little hole and then you're basically pulling that into there. So it's like when I took it out before, you see on the end on this catch here, to get it out as I did before you pull that and that will then pull it back away for it to come out. And the going back in is exactly the same, so I pop it in there and put it across. Now obviously I'm fairly tall, I mean you can have this wherever you need to be that's comfortable for you for you to do it and this is quite a spread here so and then we just need the post, hold it, we put this end in here and twist it round. Well, I hope you enjoyed today's video and look at the, the awning on the Grand California behind me. Uh, so as normal, if, uh, if you've enjoyed today's video, give us a thumbs up, give us a like. Uh, if you don't want to subscribe, please subscribe and we'll see you next time.